let us now see what are these 64 possible combinations and what amino acids that they represent. So, this is known as the codon dictionary. the codon dictionary. This is how the codon dictionary can be understood. Here I am going to write U C A G uracil cytosine adenine guanine. This is the first nitrogen base of the triplet. This will be the first nitrogen base of the triplet. Again here I am going to write U C A G. This will be the second base of the triplet codon. And for each of these boxes, I am going to write here U C A G. This will be the third base of the triplet. First base, second base, third base. So, u, u, u. So, for this column, in all the four boxes, the second base will be U. So, U, 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 C, U, U, A and U, U, G. Now, the first base will be C, second base will be U. So, C, U, U, C, U, C, C, U, A, C, U, G. For this box, the first base will be A, second base will be U, then U, C, A, G. So, A, U, U, A, U, C, A, U, A, A, U, G. For this box, first base will be G, second base will be U. G U U, G U C, G U A, G U G. <coughs> when you come to this column, first base U, second base will be always throughout C. So, U, C U 
U C U U C C U C A U C G C and C easier way of writing first base second base then you write here U C A G first base second base A C A C A C then U C A G first base G second base C G C G C G C G C E then U C A G now the second base is going to be A so U A U A U A U A U A U C A G C and A C A C and A U C A G A and A A A A A A A A A U C A G G and A G A G A G A G A U C A and G now the second base is going to be G so U G U C A G first base C second base G C G U C A G first base A second base G A G U C A G first base G second base G G G U C A G these are the 64 possible combinations 64 possible combinations I'll put an asterisk mark for three of these for these three I will put an asterisk mark because these three codons do not specify any amino acid I will come back to them later these two U U U and U U C U U U and U U C code for phenyl alanine phenyl alanine has two codons U U U U U C these two and these four code for leucine so leucine has six codons six codons these three A U U A U C A U A code for isoleucine 
A U G alone codes for the amino acid methionine. Methionine. These four code for the amino acid valine. Valine has four codons. Methionine has one codon. Isoleucine has three codons. Leucine has six codons. Phenylalanine has two codons. These four code for serine, amino acid serine. These four code for amino acid proline. These four code for amino acid Trionin, trionin. These four code for amino acid alanine, alanine. So each of these amino acids has four codons, four codons. These two code for the amino acid tyrosine. I'll come back to them. These two, they don't code for any amino acid. These two code for histidine. These two code for glutamine amino acid glutamine these two code for amino acid aspergine these two code for the amino acid lysine these two code for the amino acid glutamic acid these two code for the amino acid aspartic acid so you can see here some amino acids have two codons each two codons each U G U <coughs> these two code for amino acid cysteine. This does not code for any amino acid. U G G codes for amino acid tryptophan. These four code for the amino acid arginine. These two for serine. These two for again arginine. And these four code for glycine. This is called the codon dictionary. From this codon dictionary what you can infer is that there are 61 codons for 20 amino acids. except these three 61 codons 
for 20 amino acids right there are amino acids there is one amino acid with amino acids with only one codon there are two amino acids with only one codon one is methionine AUG methionine has only one codon that is AUG tryptophan has only one codon tryptophan has only one codon that is UGG there are many amino acids with two codons each many amino acids with two codons each so there are amino acids with two codons each how many of them are one two three four five six seven eight and nine so nine amino acids with two codons each for example phenyl alanine phenyl alanine has two codons u u u u u c so nine amino acids with two codons each there is only one codon with there is only one amino acid with three codons one amino acid with three codon one amino acid with three codons that is isoleucine isoleucine has three codons a u u a u c a u a there are some amino acids with four codons valine alanine threonine proline glycine so there are amino acids with four codons each for example proline not serine serine has six proline threonine alanine glycine valine for example proline proline has four codons ccu ccc cca ccg like this four codons you have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 six amino acids have four codons each and there are amino acids with as many as six codons look at arginine six codons serine six codons so amino acids with six codons each two of them arginine and serine for example arginine arginine 
has four codons here, two codons here. C G U C C G C C G A C G G A G A and A G G. So sixty one codons for twenty amino acids. These sixty one codons are known as sensible codons. Sensible codons. These three, we have marked three of them: UAA, UAG, and UGA. Do not code for any amino acid. So, UAA, UAG, and UGA. These three codons do not code for any amino acid. Do not code for any amino acid, and therefore they are known as they are known as nonsense codons. Sensible codons, each of which code for a particular amino acid. Nonsense codons. codons which do not code for any amino acid but these codons are important because they are chain terminators or stop signals so this is the codon dictionary